Hey everyone, thanks for logging on to WXYZ.com. I'm 7 First Alert Meteorologist Mike Taylor. We'll look at the rest of the weekend. The clouds, unfortunately, are going to hang tough. That means it'll be tough to warm up into the day tomorrow. So a mostly cloudy uh, finish to the day. We'll break the clouds up a little bit into the overnight hours, but then once we hit your Sunday, the clouds come right back. We're going to start off with numbers in the 50s. By the afternoon, a few showers, not going to rule that out. This will be because of a warm front that's going to lift back into the area. So even though it is a warm front, we're not going to feel the warmth behind this air mass, at least not until Monday. For Sunday, it's going to be about clouds, also an opportunity of rain. That'll make it tough to warm up, so the best we can do, highs in the upper 60s in most spots, maybe even the mid 50s. Rain about a 30% chance here, but once we get towards your Monday and Tuesday, those numbers are going to skyrocket back into the 80s. Muggy meter climbs as well, and we'll have another round of seeing some showers and storms both Monday as well as Tuesday, but neither day is going to be a washout. 55 degrees for tonight. Winds will be fairly light from the east-northeast. 67, best we can do tomorrow for a high. Even cooler outside of the city. Uh, let me show you the seven-day forecast. There's about a chance of rain every single day leading into next week. And that's because the pattern is active. We'll have a warm front bringing us into the 80s, near record heat both Monday and Tuesday. And then after that, we start to cool down thanks to that cold front that really cools us down. Check out the numbers both Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Highs in the 60s and lows in the 50s and even the 40s. And thanks for joining us here at WXYZ.com to get your forecast information. Next planned update will be by Hallie for your Sunday morning.